Good morning, y'all. Happy Friday. Today I'm going to an Orange Theory class, my third day in a row, and I'm really, really pumped and proud of myself that I actually just signed up for three in a row because, like, I never thought I would actually, like, get this motivation. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'm gonna go to my third class in a row, day, day in a row. Yesterday was freaking killer. It was an Everest partner workout. Basically what that meant was just like a lot of inclines and not my vibe. Definitely not my favorite workout, but hopefully today will be better um, and a little bit easier just because I am more sore than I was the um, first day. After my Orange Theory class, I'm not stopping working out. Well, technically because I'm going to chill, but um, I'm going paddle boarding with Taylor because her apartment gives free paddle boards because they're literally right on the Colorado River, Lady Bird Lake, whatever. Um, so we're going to take advantage of that and go paddle boarding. And she's never been, but I have, and it's not, it's not like that hard. She was saying like, oh my God, I'm scared that I'll fall off. But like, I guess if you haven't done it, you probably think that, but um, I'm excited to get in the water because I feel like I'm definitely going to want that after Orange Theory. And I also just loved going on the lake and paddleboarding. It was just so fun and refreshing. So I'm pumped to do that today. Um, and then later tonight, I'm not really sure what we're doing. I think Ryan gets home a little bit earlier on Fridays, like 3 or something. Which honestly, right now in my life, because I'm unemployed, I'm like damn like can you just stay at work because I always use Fridays to get like the most shit done like other people use Mondays but I feel the most motivated on Friday because I'm like okay I'm gonna put away my computer for the weekend so I need to pump out like all this content try to like edit a vlog here and there to get it out for the weekend I don't know if you guys have boyfriends but if you do maybe you can relate anytime I'm around him I just don't feel as motivated to touch my computer which is good but also bad because I feel like I always have stuff to do on the computer. Um, and yeah, once he gets home, I'm just like, well, that, that was a nice edit sesh. Now, now I gotta wait till Monday, <laughs> but hopefully not. Hopefully I'll have some uh, chill times this weekend that I can edit. Cause I am backed up on vlogs, y'all. Like I don't know what happened, but I honestly haven't been touching my computer as much. Um, because of Orange Theory and just like cooking and doing other things, which is good, but also I feel like this is the time while I'm unemployed to get my content out there. So if you guys see like a random outburst of like weekend in my life, then y'all will know what's happening and it's just backed up content. Today I want to show you guys a haul that I got from Fashion Nova. Um, I don't even know, I don't even remember what I got. I think it was like a bunch of like accessories honestly because I had some credit on a gift card so I was like YOLO let's just use it. Oh that's the timer. I'm gonna go to Orange Theory and I'll talk to y'all So I just got out of Orange Theory and oh my god I am dead to say the least. My arms are freaking noodles and Ask me why I said that I could freaking paddle board after this because I don't think I can even like hold the paddle <laughs> if I'm being honest. But after every other class that I've ever done, I felt fine. Like I walked out of there like powerful and like ready to get on with my day, like feeling like a little tired, but oh my God, right now, <sighs> I feel so dead. But I just got my, um, summary because they email you like a summary of your little graph um i don't know if you guys know about orange theory but basically like you're trying to get into the orange and red um colors more so that's like when your heart rate is uh higher <laughs> i'm sorry i can't talk because i'm so brain dead right now but you also want to stay in green too i don't know i really don't understand it still like i still have to keep asking them because i don't get it um but i got a lot in the green and i'll put my graph right here so you guys can kind of see what i'm talking about um and i think that's good if you get more green but please let me know like if you guys understand like the little graphs if you then comment down below um i I'm thanking my morning self because I packed myself a banana and I have some like raspberries and blueberries um, so I can eat that before I go paddle boarding because I haven't had breakfast and I hate eating breakfast before Orange Theory. My first ever Orange Theory class, I actually went at 3 p.m. So I ate eggs and avocado before I went. I think it was like two hours before I went and I thought that would be enough time, but I literally thought I was going to throw up my food when I was in Orange Theory that first class. So never again. 
I guess everyone's different. Some people need food before they work out, but I like literally can't. Gonna eat this banana, head to the watermark. Um, Taylor said she reserved the paddle boards for 11.30 and it's 10.40. So that gives me a little time to change and rest more importantly. So I'm currently at Taylor's apartment and we are about to get the paddle boards downstairs. I am wearing this bandage kind of bathing suit. It's a one piece and I really, really like it because it like sucks me in. It's great, it's from Boohoo. Um, and then I have a little fanny pack, some sunglasses. I'm wrapping my sorority because why not? And this is the only black hat I had. So I couldn't find the Oracle one that Ryan bought me, but it's probably somewhere in his closet, honestly. My arms are dead after that workout. So probably just gonna chill on the paddle board. Hi! <laughs> Taylor's never been, so we'll see how it goes. Um, but thank God that her place is actually closer to the city, so if we want like a city view, we don't have to like paddle that far. Because last time we got paddle boards off of like Riverside Drive or whatever, um, and that was a hard paddle because we had to paddle so far to get the city view. So hopefully it should be good. So we are getting the paddle board. So Taylor had a little fiasco. She literally pushed her paddleboard all the way down and it just went running from her. So she had to chase it in the water and she like got all in. It was so funny, but I didn't film it because I'm a good friend. But <laughs> we have a city view and it's very refreshing, but I honestly thought the water was gonna be colder, so. Hello. Got back from paddle boarding and we actually went to the pool at Taylor's complex and it's an infinity pool with like a whole skyline view you probably already saw the video but it is amazing so I was just enjoying it and it was really nice just to like kind of like chill in the water because I did a lot of working out today and my arms are freaking dead so I'm gonna hop in the shower I'm going to do a little bit of a briogeo um, not mask, but I'm going to use their shampoo. I don't really feel like using the conditioner today, but I'm going to be using their shampoo and I'll actually show you which one I use. This one is the one I'm going to be using today. It's the Scalp Revival Charcoal Plus Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. It is the best feeling shampoo ever. It has like, I'm guessing it has like tea tree oil in it because it feels so invigorating. So especially because I haven't washed my hair in like three days, and I've been sweating through it. I feel like I just need something to make it feel really, really good. And I'm excited to use the shampoo. So I'm gonna go again in the shower. Um, I'm dead right now. If I didn't say it enough, I will say it a hundred more times. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. So I'm showered and honestly, it's been about 15 minutes since I got out of the shower and my head still feels a little bit like tingly and cool from the Briogeo shampoo. Um, but I'll have a link down below if you guys want to check it out. My sister has been literally talking about this shampoo for so long and they sent it to me and I was like, what the heck? Like, I feel so blessed. So I'm trying that out and I also want to do the conditioner mask, but I think that one like sits in your head for 20 minutes before you shower. I'm not really positive, but every time I've showered, I like wanted to just get in the shower and not just like sit in my sweat you know right now i'm kind of getting a little bit hungry so i'm deciding if i want to do an apple or a smoothie part of me wants to do an apple because it's not much cleaning up but then a smoothie sounds really good and i have a banana that's about to go to waste so i might do the smoothie but right now i also need to do some work before ryan gets home um i have to make some date cards for my vlogs i have not done that in so long i haven't updated them and I really, really want new day cards because, uh, by the way, day cards means like the date is down here. And like when I say happy Friday, it says like the date. I want new ones because I feel like it kind of gets confusing. Even for me, like if I'm going back on a vlog and watching it, like I obviously want to know like what the specific date that I filmed it on. So, so I definitely want to get those made. But that takes a long time because I am going to do it through After Effects and I'm only at the beginning stages of learning it. So... It takes me a while, but it's also really fun learning After Effects. So 
So I realized I only ate fruits, so I decided to microwave some of these sausages and I have my smoothie. So I just did my makeup and I think it looks really good. Um, I don't know what is going on with my hair right now though, but I'm gonna get that figured out later. Um, right now I wanna do a haul and it is from Fashion Nova. <laughs> and um, I pretty much got a lot of accessories more than clothing, but I thought I would share it with you guys anyways because i don't know hauls are fun and stuff so here we go first starting out with this little uh bandana thingy i love this color i love anything neutral just because you can wear it more often um and i don't really know if i'll actually wear this i don't know i'm not like one of those girls that is good with accessorizing i really wish i was because that's what makes or breaks your outfit i feel like um but it's one of those like silk ones and it looks really cute in the picture. So, are you clothed? Okay, well I'm filming. It's more like a peachy color honestly, but I don't know, I like it. I definitely need to Pinterest ways to wear it. And then I have, what's this? Okay, ooh! Okay, so I got a cheetah hair clip. And I know you could probably get a lot of these on Amazon, but you know what? I was already on the site, so I got this. Um, next up, I got sunglasses. And I just wanted some really badass bitch ones. So I picked these those? up. Yes. I don't know if they're gonna look good. They're actually so cool. Ryan, what do you think? <laughs> cool, right? Like Margot Robin. Ooh, we love that. <laughs> I okay. I want to show you this hat, Ryan, because it's kind of like a cowboyish kind of thing. It was on sale, so I was like, all right. <laughs> Sophie, I'm doing a haul right now. I cannot play. Okay. Okay. So it's this cowboyish hat kind of thing, and it has like this cool embellishment. See it? It's like very colorful. Again, the model wore it really well, so and it was on sale. <laughs> um, and then I got another hat. Where'd it go? I literally just saw it. I couldn't really tell what it looked like because sometimes like they don't give you the whole view of the hat. Um, but this is the next hat. It has a little pom pom thing. I should probably try on the other hat. It's kind of cute. It's like pretty good material for how cheap it was. Like these hats were literally so cheap. And um, I don't know if I told you guys this, but I had like credit on my account. <laughs> this is the cowboy hat thingy. Kind of cool. I am yet to wear my cowboy boots here in Austin. These are work pants. Okay, babe, are you serious? <laughs> Since I'm gonna try to get a job sooner or later, um, I got these. They're very, very stretchy. They already looked really, really comfy online, so I picked them up and hopefully they fit because Fashion Nova's return policy is bull crap. The next one is, don't really know. Oh, okay, okay. Funny story. Well, not really funny story, but a story. Um, I had this one jumpsuit. I think it's from Boohoo. I will insert all the pictures that I have worn this jumpsuit in. I literally wear it every single time. I don't know what to wear. Like, it's just the easiest freaking thing. Most comfy. I don't have to wear a bra. Like, literally my favorite outfit ever. Unfortunately, it is on its last thread, literally, because it's, like, tearing apart. Um, so I decided to get another one. So it's literally just this um, tube top kind of thing. And it's a jumper, but like the pants are joggers. So it's very, very comfortable. Um, hopefully I don't have to wear a bra with this one either. The other one was kind of like a ruching um, material at the top. So I could get away with not wearing a bra, but whatever, if I have to wear a strapless, it's all good. Next thing I got is a really interesting and cool thing. And like something very unexpected for me, but honestly, like you only live once, I guess. So. It's this camera bag. It's literally a bag. I don't know when I'm going to wear this or if I will wear it. And I don't know how to open it either. <laughs> is it not it's, cool? No, it's very you. Is it? I don't know about the, the rhinestones, but everything else Oh, is. shit. I guess I didn't really see that, but whatever. I don't know. I thought it was, like, cool and, like, a little cute Tumblr. thing to have. Like, 
yeah, very tumbler, honestly. So it comes with a little strap. Um, so I guess if I don't have much to carry, which I always do, I'll use this and be cool with my little camera bag. Literally, a camera bag. Okay, I think this is the last thing I got and it's probably the most exciting one and I really, really hope these fit because I got new boyfriend jeans. You guys probably saw my uh, video that I like, you know, kind of told you guys that I gained a little weight and that I didn't fit in my other boyfriend jeans that I loved so much. So I decided to go up a size. I got this in an 11 and they're just ripped and then they have like the raw hem. I really like the raw hems on the bottom of the jeans. Like Madewell has so many jeans I want right when I get a job. Well, probably not right when I get a job because I have to save money, but like still, when I start making the good money, <laughs> the big bucks, I will be able to shop at Madewell and I'll get some jeans from there because their jeans just look so nice and I felt them they were really stretchy and good so so that's all I got from Fashion Nova I'll have all the links down below also um, I just looked at that green top I just wore on my Instagram it's from Fashion Nova as well I'm not sure if I can like find the link because I literally bought it like a year or two ago but I'll put the photo right here because you guys loved that top um, and I feel like I should wear color more often but I just I just feel like it's harder to get away with like wearing it so often, you know, because people can tell. Anyways, we're going to make some ramen mm -hmm. and then we are going to go out tonight with Ryan's friends from work and should be good. Do you know where we're going? Do you know if it's Rainy Street or 6th Street? <laughs> no, really? Yeah, so we don't have to go to I mean, like, I... What? I told Bob to go to after Oh. And you can buy Mary Sid's well, Mary out of town, but I might invite Taylor. I'm sure friends come too. Yeah, okay. Cool, cool. So I tried on the jeans, and they're actually still tight, which is kind of annoying. You like my hat? Yeehaw. <laughs> um, yeah, I probably should have sized up. What happened, Sophie? Ryan just set off the fire alarm. <laughs> this is why we don't let you cook. <laughs> <laughs> you guys scared, Sophie? Wow. <laughs>